Uh, hello, my name is Bronwyn Sweeney. I graduated from AUR in 2007, and I currently live in London, where I am a group creative director in an advertising agency by day, and I'm a stand-up comedian by night. I see the difference, I feel the difference in myself. Um, I was just saying to Professor Fitzsimmons that I feel like they look younger and younger to me every year and it's bizarre that I was ever that age and sitting in a classroom here but um, no it's truly terrifying. Time is real. I mean my favorite thing to do in Rome was just to like wander around and look for quiet side streets. I was always in search of new coffee shops. Um, I used to love going to the big park of Villa Pamphili um, to go write in my journal in the days before having internet on your phone. So you could often find me wandering around the city, writing down my thoughts and my feelings. I used to go to this um, pub. I don't think it exists anymore. It was called the Dog and Duck and it was this late night bar that you could only find after a few drinks and it was um, somewhere in the Jewish quarter. It was always this place I would take friends if they came to visit because again you could you would never know it existed in the day but I think now it's been converted into like a real estate um, like an estate agent which is really sad. <laughs> I did learn to speak Italian uh, quite fluently. I don't think I ever tried to tell jokes. I wasn't a comedian yet here, um, but it's funny because I often used to say that I, I felt like I couldn't be funny in Italian. I found it was really hard to go from, you know, being myself in English to trying to be funny. So I would rely a lot on physical humor. Um, but my dream now is to do some stand up in Italian. So watch the space. Rome in one word, um, I would probably say timeless. Um, I've been coming back, I mean, I, the first time I came to Rome was in 2003, where I had my very first cappuccino at the Archie Bar, and the same person who made that cappuccino was still there today. <laughs> and I think it's, it's comforting. I love coming back to Rome because you can see how it changes and progresses in many ways, but I also love that it kind of retains its soul no matter what happens in the rest of the world you could always come back to Rome and kind of find familiar faces familiar feelings the buildings everything there's just a, a vibe about it that feels timeless to me I kind of just miss how spontaneous you can be I like that you can kind of meet a friend for a coffee and see where it goes whereas I feel like living in London anyway everything's always planned you've got to book things in advance you've got to make plans because your friends live halfway across the city and I love that you can kind of come to Rome and just um, kind of go with the flow. I feel like in a way that in London, you just don't do that. You're in Rome. It sounds obvious, but make the most of your time here. I always felt like so many people I knew, you know, used Rome as a base to get out and see other places where I think, you know, make the most of the city that you're in. If you can learn the language, find ways to learn the language, meet locals, get a job. It changes completely how you see this place when you can express yourself and meet people from here. Um, so my advice would be, yeah, make the most of the city that you're in. AUR will forever be such a special place to me and because I think that for anyone who decides to come to school here, no matter where you come from in life, you instantly have something that bonds you to the people that come to school here, whether they're Italian, whether they're from your country or from wherever else in the world. And I think that what's so special about AUR is that you, I have remained in touch with a lot of the people that I became friends with here because we shared this common experience that no one else would really understand. Do you know what I mean? We, it's not a massive university. I feel like I stay in touch with people because it's really hard to explain that I went to university in, a, in, a, in Rome at this special little place on the top of a hill. You know what I mean? Um, I think you're kind of bonded for life in that sense. 